Hi, welcome to Land of Chemistry, Simple Steps to Organic Chemistry. In this video, we are going to learn the IUPAC nomenclature of carboxylic acid. Come on, let's get into the video. Carboxylic acid. The functional group of carboxylic acid is C double bond O OH. This is the functional group of carboxylic acid. We can write it as COOH also. Okay. Here R can be attached. This R can be either alkyl or an aryl. Okay. If it is carboxylic acid, the suffix in the IUPAC name, the suffix in the IUPAC name is oic acid. For example, if this carboxylic acid is attached to methane, that is methane plus oic acid, it forms methanoic acid or else methanoic acid. Come on, let's learn some examples for carboxylic acid. The first one is HCOOH. The second one is CH3COOH. CH3COOH. CH2 CH2 CH3 CH2 CH3 CH2 CH2 COOH and the fifth one is CH3 CH2 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 COOH first let's give the common name for this structure this is formic acid HCOOH is known as formic acid And this one is CH3COOH is known as acetic acid, which is present in vinegar. And the third one is propionic acid. Three carbons are there. So propionic acid. The fourth one is N-butyric acid. Because the four carbons are there, four carbons are present in the straight chain. So we are writing N. So butyric acid. N butyric acid is the common name for the fourth one. And the fifth one, five carbons are there, and here the COOH group is present. This is known as N valeric acid. N valeric acid is the common name for the fifth one. Come on, let's give the IUPAC name for these compounds now. Here, only one carbon is present, so it is known as methane. Instead of writing E, we need to write oic acid because COOH is present. So, methane oic acid, which is known as methanoic acid. Here, one, two carbons are there. So, ethane. Instead of writing E, oic acid because COOH is the functional group. That is, carboxylic acid is the functional group. So, we are writing as ethanoic acid. So, the IUPAC name of acetic acid is ethanoic acid. Here, one, two, Three carbons are present. So, propanoic acid. Propanoic acid. And the fourth one. First carbon, second carbon, third carbon, fourth carbon. Four carbons are present. So, butan. Here, COOH is present. So, oic acid. Butanoic acid. The last one is one, two, three, four. 5 carbons are present in the straight chain. 5 carbons in the sense it is pentan. Here what is the functional group? COOH is the functional group that is carboxylic acid. If the functional group is carboxylic acid, the suffix will be oic acid. So pentanoic acid is the IUPAC name of valeric acid. Come on, let's learn some more compounds. The next one is CH3, CH2, CH2. CH2, CH2, COOH, 
CH3, C, CH3, H, COO, H, CH3, CH, double bond, CH, single bond, COO, H, CH2, double bond, CH, single bond, COO, H. Come on, first give the common name for these compounds now. The common name for this compound is caproic acid. C-A-P-R-O-I-C. Caproic acid is the common name of the first carbon. Here six carbons are there totally. Okay. Here, this one. The second one is one, two, three, four carbons. Totally four carbons and it has one branch. If it has one branch in the sense, we need to write ISO. So, ISO, four carbons are present in the all together. So, isobutyric acid. This is unsaturated carboxylic acid which contains four carbons and a double bond. It is known as crotonic acid. And the last one in this slide is here three carbons are present. And it is also an unsaturated carboxylic acid. It is known as acrylic acid. Come on, let's give the IUPAC name for these compounds now. Here, how many carbons are present? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 carbons are present. So, hexane. Hexane. The functional group is COOH. So, oic acid. Hexanoic acid is the IUPAC name of caproic acid. And the second one, this is the first carbon, second carbon and this is the third carbon, longest chain. Here to the second carbon, methyl group is attached. So, 2-methyl, in the straight chain, 3 carbons are present, propan, the functional group is COOH, so oic acid. The IUPAC name of isobutyric acid is 2-methyl propanoic acid. That is 2-methyl propanoic acid. Come on, let's give the IUPAC name for protonic acid now. This is first carbon and this is second carbon. This is third one and this is fourth carbon. Here, four carbons are present in the straight chain. So, but, not in, because this is unsaturated. The double bond is present in the second carbon. So, 2 in. Here, the priority goes to carboxylic acid. So, this comes in second one. Here the priority, we need to give the priority to the carboxylic acid. So the double bond is present in the second carbon. So but 2 in oic acid. The last one in this slide. This is first carbon, second carbon and third carbon. Here three carbons are present in the straight chain. So prop. In the second carbon double bond is there. So 2 in and here the functional group is carboxylic acid. So oic acid. Or else simply we can write it as propene oic acid. Propene oic acid. Come on, let's learn some more compounds. The next one is CH3, C, H, O, H, C, O, O, H. CH3, C, Double bond O C O O H and C six H five C O O H. This is aryl carboxylic acid to the benzene ring. Carboxylic acid group is attached. And the next one is C six H five C H two C O O H to the benzene ring CH2 OH is attached sorry to the benzene ring CH2 COOH is attached come on let's give the common name for these compounds now the common name of this compound is lactic acid which is present in the milk lactic acid here hydroxyl group is also present and carboxylic acid group is also present this is known as lactic acid and this is pyruvic acid 
the name of this compound is pyruvic acid here keto group is present and carboxylic acid group is present this is benzoic acid to the benzene ring this is benzoic acid to the benzene ring carboxylic group is attached it is known as benzoic acid and this one is ch3cooh is acetic acid in the acetic acid instead of one hydrogen here phenyl group is attached so phenyl acetic acid phenyl acetic acid come on let's give the iupac name for these compounds now the first one this is first carbon second carbon third carbon to the second carbon hydroxy group is present that is alcoholic group is present so two hydroxy in the straight chain three carbons are present so propanoic acid two hydroxy propanoic acid and here this is first carbon second carbon and third carbon in the second carbon oxo is present that is keto so we need to write two oxo propanoic acid and the third one is this is benzene and this is carboxylic acid so benzene carboxylic acid and the fourth one is this is acetic acid the iupac name of acetic acid is ethanoic acid in the ethanoic acid this is first carbon and this is second carbon to the second carbon phenyl group is attached so two phenyl ethanoic acid this is the iupac name of phenyl acetic acid come on let's learn some more compounds now the next one is to the benzene ring oh group is attached and cooh group is attached in the same way this is benzoic acid we know that along with this in the adjacent carbon nh2 that is amino group is attached the third one is c6h5 single bond ch double bond ch single bond cooh okay the fourth one is C six H five C H two single bond C H two single bond C O O H. Come on, let's give the common name for these compounds now. This one, if the O H and C O O H group is present in the adjacent carbon in the benzene ring, it is known as salicylic acid. in the same way if amino group and carboxylic acid group is present in the adjacent carbon in the benzene ring it seems it is known as antranilic acid and this is known as cinnamic acid c6h5 single bond ch double bond ch single bond cooh this is known as cinnamic acid and this is to the cinnamic acid here one hydrogen is attached and here one hydrogen is attached so this is known as hydro cinnamic acid the hydrogen is added two hydrogens are added to the cinnamic acid in the second carbon and third carbon so it is known as hydro cinnamic acid come on let's give the iupac name for these compounds now this is first carbon and this is second carbon so this is known as in the second carbon hydroxy group is attached so two hydroxy benzoic acid and this one this is first carbon and this is second carbon so in the second carbon amino group is present so two amino benzoic acid or else two amino benzene carboxylic acid both are correct and here 
this is first carbon and this is second carbon this is third carbon in cinnamic acid in the third carbon phenyl group is attached this is phenyl so three phenyl prop three carbons are in the state chain so prop in the second carbon double bond is present so so two in oic acid so the iupac name of cinnamic acid is 3 phenyl prop 2 in oic acid and here the last one that is hydrocinnamic acid this is first carbon second carbon third carbon to the third carbon phenyl group is attached so 3 phenyl here single bond is present so propan oic acid so the iup is in name of hydrocinnamic acid is 3 phenyl propanoic acid come on let's learn some more compounds next ch3 c next ch3 c ch3 double bond ch single bond c o o h and then here c o o h and in this position c h 3 the next one is n h2 ch2 c o o h come on let's give the common name for these compounds now the common name of this compound is senesioic acid okay and here there is no common name only iupac name for this compound and the common name for the third compound that is nh2 ch2 coh here the carboxylic group and the amino group is attached to the carbon this is known as amino acid which together forms protein okay there is another name for this compound this is alpha amino carboxylic acid or else alpha amino acetic acid that is ch3 coh is acetic acid instead of one hydrogen in acetic acid here amino group is attached so alpha amino acetic acid this is the first amino acid okay the name is glycine come on now let's give the iupac name for these compounds here this is first carbon second carbon third carbon and this is fourth carbon to the third carbon methyl group is attached so 3 methyl in the straight chain there are four carbons so but in the second carbon there is double bond so 2 in and here oic acid carboxylic acid present so oic acid so the iupac name of the first compound is 3 methyl but 2 in oic acid and the second one this is a cyclopentane okay in this cyclopentane this is first carbon and this is second carbon so 2 methyl cyclopentane and this is carboxylic acid so the iupac name of this compound is 2 methyl cyclopentane carboxylic acid finally the iupac name of glycine is this is first carbon and this is second carbon to so the second carbon amino group is attached so 2 amino acetic acid or else ethanoic acid thank you by this we have completed the carboxylic acid that is the naming of carboxylic acid we shall see in the next video bye